Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. I hope you all are doing well. So in today's video, I have a drugstore makeup product review for you guys. I have here the new Essence Hydra Kiss Lip oils. Essence did release three shades. However, I was only able to get my hands on two. Unfortunately, the third one was out of stock. So if you guys are interested in seeing me swatch these, demo these, and share my honest thoughts with you guys, then make sure to keep on watching. All right, you guys. So I'm super excited to be testing these out and sharing my thoughts with you guys. So just for reference, the two shades that I grabbed are Kiss from a Rose, which is like a nice pink shade and I also got honey honey which is like a nice orange so we all know that lip oils are super trendy right now everybody is releasing lip oils people are just loving lip oils for every day it's just become like the go-to lip product I will say however that lip oils can run a little bit more expensive and one thing I can appreciate about essence is that their pricing is quite reasonable so these lip oils actually retail for $5.99 which is pretty reasonable compared to other lip lip oils that I have in my collection. So I am on the Shoppers Drug Mart website right now because that's where I purchased my lip oils. And it says here that this is a product that has a high gloss finish and a hint of color, which is nice. I'm excited to see that hint of color. It says here that this product is infused with hyaluronic acid, jojoba oil, vitamin E, and metafoam oil, which is all great products to really nourish your lips and moisturize them. So considering the price point and what you're getting with these products, I feel like that is such a steal. Like a lot of these ingredients will come in lip oils that are really, really expensive. So definitely I really wanted to give these new oils a try just to see how they perform and how they feel on the lips. So enough of the chitter chatter, let's actually jump into these products. So I want to go in with the first lip oil. This is the shade kiss from a rose which has a nice light pink tint so I'll quickly swatch it on my hand and then we'll pop it on the lips let's go ahead in and swatch it so it says that it should have like a subtle tint but I am not really seeing too much this is looking pretty clear in my opinion let me know in the comments down below if you guys see a tint but to me this just looks straight up clear all right let's try this product on the lips All right, so here is Kiss From A Rose applied and it's basically just a fully clear gloss on my lips and even when I swatched it on my hand, you guys saw it was basically clear, but this stuff feels really nice on the lips, you guys. It's super moisturizing. It feels really soft on the lips. I really like it. Next up, we have Honey Honey, which is like a really nice orange. I'm excited to see how this one applies on the lips as well as the swatch, just because it looks like it has a lot more pigment than the um, Kiss From A Rose. Like this one looks pretty clear. Let's go ahead in and swatch this one. Oh yeah, this one, it's still very clear, but I can see like a super subtle orange tint. It's very, very subtle. I would say for the most part, this is also basically clear. Clear. This basically smells the same. I think what we're smelling is the jojoba oil and just like the ingredients in general in this lip oil. It does smell nice, so I'm not complaining. Let's go ahead in and pop this on the lips. I did forget to show you guys, but the applicator is a really nice big applicator, which is good for quick application on the lips. This one for the most part is also a clear oil, you guys, as you guys can see. However, I am noticing like a subtle difference, like a really subtle warmth to the lips, especially on my lower lips, just because I have less discoloration on the lower lips. So you can see a super subtle tint. It's barely there, you guys. Like I probably could have just gone away with having one of these in my collection. Like I don't need both because they're basically doing the same thing. Feels super good on the lips, feels super comfortable. I love it. Now, let's just wrap up the review by using these products as like a lip topper. I think I'm going to go in with the um, Kiss From A Rose as a lip topper just because that looked very like more clear to me. So we're going to go in with this. All right. So for the lip look, we're first going in with a lip liner. This is the Wet n Wild Lip Liner in Chestnut. Chestnut. 
For lipstick, I'm gonna go in with Huda Beauty. This is her Power Bullet Matte Lipstick, and I have the shade here, Interview. And let's finish off the look with the Essence Lip Oil right on top. Wow, I absolutely love this as a lip topper. I feel like this just elevated the lip look. I purposely did like a deeper lip liner with a lighter lipstick just to get a nice ombre. And this just on top really finishes off the look and gives a really nice pout. So definitely these are great to add for super glam looks as well. All right, you guys, so that is pretty much it for today's review on the new Essence Hydra Kiss lip oils. Overall, I would say these are great lip oils to have. I mean, for the price point of $5.99, which is what I paid from Shoppers Drug Mart, which is a drugstore near me, I think it's a pretty great product and you're getting a pretty big bottle as well. Lip oils are great for every day if you need something to pop on your lips to add nice moisture and glow. And they're also fun for glam looks, just like how I showed you guys with the lip look that I'm wearing right now. If you're planning on buying these, I would suggest just getting one because as you guys can see, there's barely a tint to these. They're practically clear, so it's not really necessary to buy more than one because you're just gonna get the same product twice. Let me know in the comments down below if you guys have tried this lip oil out and let me know what your thoughts are. If you guys enjoyed this video, please don't forget to give it a big thumbs up so I know you enjoyed it and don't forget to subscribe to my channel and hit that notification bell so you never miss an upload and you guys that is pretty much it I want to thank you so much for watching and I'll see you guys in my next one bye guys